and they have the data, mm -hmm. they've got some of the smartest engineers on the planet. Coming into the year, I identified Alphabet as one of the mega caps that I felt had the most opportunity. Hey everyone, in this video, I'm gonna highlight where I think Alphabet stock price could go by the year 2030. So this will be my 2030 stock price prediction for Alphabet stock. Now to make this prediction, I'll be using several estimates and assumptions. And remember, nobody knows what's gonna happen in the future. All we could do is use the numbers we have at our disposal to make a forecast. So this is a highly uncertain situation. Nevertheless, these are the numbers I've got and this is my forecast for where I think Alphabet stock price could be. So let's begin this interesting analysis here. So one of the first numbers I'll need to make this estimate is Alphabet's current forward price to earnings ratio. It's trading right now at a 19.86 forward PE. I'm going to need this number to make the stock price prediction. I'm also going to need Alphabet's current stock price. Right now it's trading at $155 per share and 92 cents. I also need its earnings per share for 2025. That number is right here. Analysts on Wall Street expect Alphabet to deliver $7.82 in earnings per share next year. That'll be up from $6.80 in earnings per share this year. So analysts expect a roughly $1 increase in earnings per share for Alphabet next year. Additionally, I need Alphabet's growth estimate for earnings per share. So analysts on Wall Street that are following Alphabet stock, they expect it to increase its earnings per share by 19.25 percent over the next five years. I'm going to use that estimate to forecast where its earnings per share will be in the year 2030 and the year 2031. So I'm going to combine those estimates, extend it out one year longer and make a prediction, make a forecast for Alphabet's earnings per share. So now that we've pulled together the numbers that we need for our forecast, here is our evaluation model. So let me draw your attention first on the left hand side here where I have the earnings per share for 2025. Remember, I got that from the Yahoo Finance consensus estimate on Wall Street for where Alphabet's earnings per share will be $7.82. I pulled that directly from Yahoo Finance. Also, I got from Yahoo Finance the 19.25% growth rate. This is the consensus estimate among Wall Street analysts that are following Alphabet stock. This is what they think Alphabet's earnings per share will grow at over the next five years. Now, when you're making a prediction for the year 2030 using the forward price to earnings ratio, you need the earnings per share one year ahead. So if I'm making Making a prediction like I am in this video for 2030, I need the earnings per share for 2031. And that's what I got here. So to get this 2031 earnings per share estimate, I took the $7.82 expectation for 2025, applied the 19.25% growth rate for six years to get $22.49 earnings per share expected in 2031. So if you now draw your attention here to the right hand side where we have the $22.49 cents earnings per share. If we combine that with the forward PE of 19.86, where Alphabet is currently trading at, Alphabet stock price could increase to $446.62 by the year 2030. And if you remember, its current stock price is 155. So that would be a near tripling of its stock price in, oh, let's say about six years. That would be an excellent rate of return. I do own Alphabet stock and I would be pleased with that rate of return. I like that rate of return especially considering the risk profile of Alphabet stock. Alphabet is not one of the more riskier stock. It has an absolutely pristine balance sheet. It's trading at a relatively cheap valuation. Its market share in search and online video is strong. The business model is profitable. It's lucrative. User generated content is a lucrative business model that generates strong profitability as Alphabet has demonstrated for the past decade. So it's not a very risky stock. And yet yet you're getting this kind of rate of return expectation from Alphabet if all else remains the same. But what if its earnings per share actually increases to 22, then the stock price could rise to $494 per share. If the earnings per share rises to 25, the stock price could rise to $562 per share. And even in the scenario where its earnings per share falls, I'm sorry, the forward price to earnings, I should say, falls to 15, then the stock price will still expect it to rise to $337 per share by 2030. So even in the scenario where the PE falls, if the EPS 
stays the same and the stock price still more than doubles in that time frame so you could see why alphabet you could see why i own alphabet in fact i've rated alphabet as my top stock to buy in 2024 partly because of these robust expectations for alphabet over the next several years it's got excellent earnings per share expectations for the next five years it's trading at a relatively cheap valuation and so if you forecast that earning growth out with this current valuation you get robust increases in the price so given these four scenarios where do i think is the most probable outcome what's my base case scenario for alphabet stock in 2030 well i expect a bit of the first two scenarios a combination of the first scenario of 446 and the second scenario of 494 my estimate for where I think Alphabet stock price will be in 2030 is a range of between $450 and $500 per share by 2030, which is a roughly triple from where it is today, an excellent rate of return to be sure if Alphabet indeed hits this price target for 2030. But again, this is just an estimate. As you've seen, I've used several assumptions and estimates to make this calculation, and many things could be wrong here, and even a slight variation in any of the figures could cause a big difference in the price just one example here if you look at a, a pe of 25 or a pe of 15 that could be a difference of 230 dollars per share on the stock price and similarly if you were to change these estimates here slightly from 19.25 percent to 15 percent that could make a big difference in the the market price for alphabet stock so all of these variables have huge implications for alphabet's stock price and where it could be if the earnings per share are worse than expected then the stock price forecast is likely to be worse than expected if the earnings per share grow at 15 percent instead of 19 percent then i would expect the price to be a lot less than at 19 percent if the earnings per share was to grow at 25 percent instead of 19 percent then i think they, there would be considerably more upside for alphabet stock by 2030 so the earnings per share and the valuation multiple are two primary factors that could influence where the stock price could be by 2030 and i think more importantly is the earnings per share and the earnings per share growth rate if the earnings per share growth rate increases that would increase the valuation multiple investors would be willing to pay for alphabet stock because its earnings are growing at a faster rate investors are willing to pay higher prices for companies that have higher earnings growth so the earnings per share growth rate is a very important factor to be sure nevertheless here's my price target for alphabet stock by the end of 2030 and as a shareholder myself i'm certainly hoping it hits near these targets by 2030 before I let you go, let me tell you about the greatest deal on YouTube. With just a click of a button, you can get free financial analysis from a professor with decades of investing experience. So what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button and I'll see you again soon.